What's to do YouTube? It's Holy One, and this is gonna be my second video of how to make sure your PC doesn't have frame rate stuttering and runs more smoothly. So another method you can do is once again typing in msconfig, <clears throat> go to boot, advanced options, click on maximum memory. Now I have 40 gigs of RAM installed. Make sure that the amount of RAM you have installed appears here. So if you have 16, it'll say 16,000. If it says 8,000, you don't have 16,000. So you need to make sure that's fixed. And if you do have the right amount <clears throat> in this box, you're good. So just copy and paste this, and you don't have to restart the PC with that whatsoever. Then search your control panel. <clears throat> go to system and security go to system information and make sure installed memory RAM says 40 for you if it's a 16 or 8 make sure it says that amount because what Windows will do is default to half of that so if I have 40 gigs it would default to 20 make sure it has that correctly installed there and to fix that you can um, the best thing you can do is reset your PC um, or you guys can look up other ways of doing that without resetting your PC make sure this box is checked to best performance that will really help a lot and then make sure adjusted for best performance is set to programs go to virtual memory click change this is for all your hard drives and allowing how much RAM they can use go to every single hard drive you have and ch and click on custom size paste the RAM size I just did so that each hard drive can use the maximum RAM usage usually these are set to as you can see it originally was set to 6 gigs of RAM maximum utilization for each hard drive. So just hit OK. After doing that, hit Apply, hit Apply, and boom. <clears throat> it's that easy. And now, for the next method, go to NVIDIA Control Panel. These are just the best optimized settings for NVIDIA. Make sure for you people running G-Sync or FreeSync that FreeSync and G-Sync are set to enable in full screen only, not in full screen and windowed. And make sure your computer is set to the correct refresh. That's just obvious. Um, set PhysX to auto. I know some people on YouTube say set it to the GPU, but that causes a lot of frame rate stuttering and a lot of games. And um, turn ambient occasion off. Turn this to 16 times. FX off. This is on application controlled. This is set to all. Turn off DSR. That's this. Set this to 3D settings. Make sure G Sync is off. Make sure OpenGL is set to auto. And um, power management, you can turn that to maximum settings as well. If you have, um, if you're having frame rate stuttering and all that sort of thing, set that to maximum performance. And make sure if you're running a G Sync with an unlocked frame rate, set this to highest setting possible. Set this to on, on, allow, and if you can, set this to either high performance or performance mode. <clears throat> um, make sure this is set to on. Threaded optimization, set that to auto. Always keep triple buffering off unless you're max if you want to run if you unless you're framing capping a game at 30 frames per second. And make sure vertical sync is off if you're having an unlocked frame rate. And make sure virtual rendered frames is set to one. Always set this to one. Never use 3D settings. Set that to one. Hit apply and you're done. And um, if you're secure. Um, if your security is running in the background, like I have Viper, if that's running in the background and it's doing like a scan with a little circle, that will also cause frame rate stuttering because the computer is sending resources to the antivirus, which will also lower your performance. So let me know if you this guy if this helps you guys. This is your boy Holy One. Ouch!